Hello Scorpio and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of April 27th through May 3rd. Yeah, we're almost in May and this is a very general reading and I hope everybody is doing great. Okay, on the plate Scorpio. Scorpio, family, love, roots, something like that is showing up. People close to you and this could be other people too that you've been close with your inner circle or something. Um... I do see someone maybe extending the olive branch, okay? Um, this could be someone wanting to apologize, someone trying to make amends um, with you, or the energy is there coming up. So that's one thing. Or there is a focus on it. Someone's thinking about it, because I do see something um, like that too. So that is showing up. Um, yeah, something is kind of concluding there. I do see success, victory, um, maybe talking to people that you haven't talked to in a while. That is showing up. And also there is some a focus on uh, readjustments with home, foundation, um, extending, expanding something, lifestyle, making some kind of adjustments. So we, adjustments. So we are seeing that energy, okay? All right. Ooh, Scorpio, what is going on here? Scorpio, you're strong. You have the strength. You're the warrior. So I do see that energy coming through despite all this kind of yellowish. I don't know. This is like some of you feel spiritually drained. These are tears, though, I have to say. Maybe it's it's regrets, losses, uh, uh, heartache, pain, or something. And that is for some of you out there. Um, but I am seeing there's abundance coming through. This is like a cornucopia type of energy. Okay, money coming through. Um, good rewards for, it's like a return of karma for some of you. So just know that. Things come on divine timing, though. It's like you're feeling trapped or tied in some kind of relationship or some kind of decision you want to make. Um, this could be some trouble in some kind of relationship. Um, you feel like your your hands are cuffed, okay? So that's another thing I'm seeing here. But you're sitting on the fence about something, okay? There are some changes, changes of perspective, um, maybe with love, matters of the heart. This is like you're sitting on the, you know, you're the fence sitter thinking, should I do this? Should I try this? It's like, um, some changes and adjustments with a love, um, perspectives, uh, something like that is showing up. I do see metamorphosis. It's like the butterfly. It's almost like the it's transformative energy. So things will be starting to start to change. Um, I do see luck is on your side. Okay, we see a four-leaf clover here. So luck is on your side. And this is also with home foundation, making some kind of good, um, some energy coming with home foundation. For some of you, it could be gardening. This is really good. It's almost like um, nature, like maybe you're planting some herbs, vegetables, or something like that. But I do see something, um, adjustments with the home foundation, something like that. But there's luck on your side here. I do see... You could be very strong taking your power back. It's like you're it's like you're executing things. It's like that's it. Cutting things up, uh only accepting what is right for you, what is not uh you know, what you want, what you don't want. Um you only want, you know, your truths, your way. So I'm seeing that taking your power back somehow. Though you will be met with some uh, roadblocks, okay? There are some things. It's like maybe you just start something and then it's like, oh, I can't do this because of this or I, or someone has a different uh, opinion. It's like, you know, you start driving down the road and then all of a sudden it's a dead end. So you have to go, you know, I see the roadblocks. Um, a little bit of anxiety. I'm not anxiety. It's more like you could be overly defensive. So just be warned of that. There are some people and situations that be leaving your life, but I think you're going to be doing this by your own hand or your own attitude. Okay, so I'm seeing that changes of perspective. Purging is showing up too. Now, I do see here a karmic relationship. You have a lot of that energy, a lot of hearts up, up in the spiritual area. Um, this is love showing up too, but this is a karmic relationship. There is a sense of a familiarity dealing with karmic loves is showing up as well. Um, I do see, uh, you know, the... You're, there's a lot of changes that are going on, even with finances, uh, with money. Um, it's like a spiral. So it's like going through loops and hoops, okay? So it's like this is making, you know, there's adjustments and changes coming in with money. Um, it's really going through this 
spiral staircase climbing slowly to the top. But, you know, you're leaving some financial worries behind, okay? So that's, uh, have faith things are going to work out. But there are some changes, okay? I do see matters of the heart. Well, this is love, and I think it's more happiness. Uh, family, something like that is looking good and shining. Um, this is like, I feel the cup overflowing. It's a very nice energy. I do see communication is coming through very strongly, um, there's going to be some messages coming in as well. And I do see this is a change of career or direction, end of a job or end of um, the way you make money in some certain areas. It's like more financial freedom, independence. Um, don't overspend either. So just kind of, you know, kind of coming to a close with something. Some of you maybe stop spending. So that's another way. Um, some of you, I do see you're taking authority. It's like you will take control of something as well. Okay, it's like your heart, you're the ruler. Okay, so it's a very strong type of energy that I'm seeing this week for you guys. But a lot of, um, you know, have faith things are going to work out. Let's put it that way. You have the strength. You have faith that you have to have faith that things are going to work out, though. I see a lot of changes occurring. It's like triple fives I'm seeing here. And that definitely is change, change, change. Okay, so look at it as an adventure. Go with the flow. Change is occurring, okay? So that's another thing I'm seeing. But you do come to some good energy. Um, but again, change is change. And it's like very hard. So it's like you're almost resistant to it, okay? <laughs> okay, well, Scorpio, that was your reading for the week of um, April 27th through May 3rd. I hope you have a wonderful week. And I'll be back next week for our next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best and bye for now.